Welcome back to Rogue Legacy. I'm Burning Dog Face, and it's been about four million years since we've been here. I'm having a very bad day. Let's see if we can't make it any better. No idea who I am or what's going on anymore. Apparently I'm a spelunker with a pitiful amount of gold. I made it very far. So it's basically a fresh run. Oh, oh wait. Man! I don't remember the last time I even got hit by a scout. Oh. I was trying to remember if it was this one. Or the other game I played. Where... You use the same button to dash, dash in both directions. You use the same button to dash in both directions. <laughs> I can't even speak. That is a nice trick, firing a uh, rocket launcher through a dwarf tunnel. I remember to check the map first. my ear now. It has been scratched. Stand down from Code Red. Well, this room has been good for my uh, end of life score, but not very good. What the? Oh yeah, down there. Is it? If I cannot reach, not very good for my wallet. So most of the money that dropped is inside of bo uh, big boxes of stone. Full health. Yes. How sweet it is. And that was going to be tricky anyway. Oh, I could have used the uh, fireball. I didn't The thing is, in a big room, there is still a joke. Oh yeah, there's a whole bunch of doors back there. It's 
stick to the castle and make some dosh. Uh -huh. This room sucks. At least I got chicken. Oh yeah. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> found a tiny sword made of butter. Thank god, I get to read this one. Bullet Odyssey. Development time, 3.5 months. Release date, November 29th. 2011. Bullet Odyssey was our very last game prior to working on Rogue Legacy. Being a bullet hell that was based on rhythm and beat charts, Bullet Odyssey was the most technically challenging game we had ever worked on. Yes, even more so than Rogue Legacy. Just to create a stage required three editors running in unison. Development for this game is also a little non-traditional as a lot of pre-planning was required to make sure everything clicked. Being heavy advocates against documentation just didn't se settle well with us, so we had to talk out the whole game for, like, half a, a day. I'm trying to work wrap my head around that one, but, you know. The game had the player absorbing enemy bullets in order to fire them back, and absorption happened on a beat which matched the song being played. The initial playtests were disastrous, as the game was too hard. People became incredibly frustrated in the very first minute. By playtests, we mean one dude who doesn't even like bullet hell. That's larger than our usual test pool. The game didn't perform very well when it released. They gave us that gave us the confidence to make Rogue Legacy. <laughs> Wonder if it's on Steam. I mean, I don't like bullet hells either, but... Whoa! Huh. Is it a 
think of this room. Oh, I have that trade. I like that one. I guess that would be on the card, huh? Yeah, platforms stay open and, uh, oh, tunnel vision, early, early indicators. Oh, that, that's like those things. You see, there's no little sign on the, uh, at the edge of the screen saying, hey, there's a, mi a missile coming this way. Didn't have to think with this room. It's created it enough times that I would certainly hope not. Why'd I smash that one? See? Now I can drink it. Ah! Huh. Nope. How oh, about no, Scott? Oh, this room sucks. I'm going to be honest with you guys. For a second there, for just a second, when he raised his hand in front of his face, I thought he was shielding his eyes from the light. that before. The sound gets louder the closer you get. Huh. No, I can't get this one. Well, I don't want that. Oh, sweet. I can teleport to the other side of the room. Going back through those ones is always kind of a bitch. Wait. Oh, but they're right there! There you go. This is the one place the, uh... Belunker's special ability comes in handy. Another one here? Nope. Fuck it. Not worth it. It's never worth exploring the, uh, Land of Darkness for treasure. I see where I'm going. Up! I didn't think I would make that jump. No, no, no. dollar dues I'm making. That would be really neat if I could find some, uh... You know what, that just leads back to the castle. Let's not. I 
yeah, there's a stump on that side, but it's something that may or may not have a treasure inside of it. Guarded by something where my terrible sense of timing will probably get me injured. Yeah, that is a thoroughly looted castle. Embarrassing. Went off too soon. But don't worry, Sir Wizerol, I hear lots of guys have that problem. <laughs> uh. Wait. Whoa! Man. My combi is okay. It never stutters when it's playing this game. Just not. Nope. I'm not interested in that. This is not an ideal location for that to happen. Notice how regularly those lights are spaced. Why don't I jump? All I had to do was nothing! I guess I don't really start doing mimics until the uh, Maya. I don't like you. Pterosaur. Was the name of one of the guys from Beast Wars? They called it Beasties in Canada for some reason. There's a reason behind it, I just don't remember what it is. And it wasn't like a copyright thing, you know, like how they uh how they renamed Zootopia Zootropolis in the UK because there is a company that exists called Zootopia. Nah, that sounds kinda rad, let's leave it. It wasn't like that, it was like... <laughs> they thought it was... They didn't... I thought it was something like they didn't want to have the word war in the title of a program meant for kids. I mean, it was perfectly alright that the characters were, you know, shooting at each other with all kinds of futuristic weaponry. I am not going to do that. I am actually not going to do it this time. I, this run is all about money, and I cannot take the chance I would get the Hedgehog's Curse. Maybe I won't. Maybe I'd get the, uh, Charon's Obol, even. But, no. I'm just not in the mood today. Oh, right. Fuck. Totally forgot about that. No, that's all sucks. <laughs> yeah.
I felt pretty good with that one. Wait, that was a that was a blaze lock? If they appear here, then what was one doing in uh I was gonna say the nether. In uh the land of darkness. Look at that! I've come to the end of the video, and I'm actually still doing pretty good with this guy. Knock on wood. Oh, oh fuck you! No! I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode. I don't even remember what silly uh, title I gave to this one. Let's let's quest Rogue Legacy. That's what it is. I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Quest Rogue Legacy. I'm gonna continue hunting for loot, and then probably die so that his uh, descendant can spend it. Later.